Okay, so here's a quick video uh, about how to install and uh, get Pronto, Prontoface working. So I have downloaded all of the software off of um, the Mendel.com website uh, into this folder here, 3D printer software. Forget about TK Inter, that was down to me making a mistake, not understanding something or other. Um, but in the uh, Prontoface folder here, we've got uh, Python, PySerial, PyRedline, WX Python, uh, and all of that needs to be installed in the order that it says on the mentalparts.com website, which is, let's just go there, mentalparts.com, go to downloads and Prontoface, uh, and it's listed here. First Python 272, then PySerial 25, then WX Python 28, then PyReadline, and then Print Run. And Print Run, there's nothing to install, it's just to be downloaded. Uh, and the reason there's nothing to be down, uh, nothing to be installed is that it's all Python scripts. The only thing you do have to do is Within the folder that um, Prontoface is in, you have to put the Skeinforge folder. And what's in there, that's the whole of Skeinforge. Let's come back out to 3D printer software, Skeinforge. There's a, in, when you download it, it's this folder called Skeinforge Shared. Uh, and in there, there's 40 rep, rep Python bean shell, and that's what goes in to the folder called Skeinforge. Okay, so you will have downloaded, you will have downloaded um, Skeinforge. You will have unzipped it, and inside the folder, the Skeinforge shared, and inside that, there's this folder called 40 wrap wrap Python bean shell. Copy the whole of that lot and put it into in Prontoface. Uh, and in, sorry, in print run in a folder called Skeinforge, all in lowercase. And then when you've done that, um, this is the script to run, prontoface.py. And what I've done is right click with my mouse, drag it out onto the desktop, uh, let go, and then do create shortcut here, which I'm not going to do because I've already done it. Uh, once you've done that, then you can start Prontoface simply by double clicking and quick as a flash, or maybe not. Oh, here we go. Uh, and it's up and running. And I get this error message here on my machine, and I don't, I, this is on my desktop, and I'm running it on my desktop because that's where I've got Camtasia, but when I do it on the laptop where um, the printer is, I don't get the problem, but that's Prontoface running. And that's it.